It's time for your Vicksburg Daily News Brief, brought to you by your friends at Cook Tractor Company. Now's the perfect time to check out the complete line of zero turns at Cook Tractor Company on Highway 80. Visit them online at cooktractorco.com or give them a call today at 601-TRACTOR. In our top story, a 15-year-old faces charges of capital murder. That and more just ahead. Two lucky players of the Mississippi Match 5 drawing get to split a $665,000 jackpot. The winning tickets were purchased only 23 miles apart, one from Dandy Dan's in Hattiesburg and another from Keith's Superstore in Ellisville. One man from Lamar County who purchased his ticket from Dandy Dan's has already claimed his share of the prize, finally convincing his wife he wasn't joking. The jackpot rolled a total of 28 times before a winning ticket was purchased. Vicksburg native Travis Williams Jr. was awarded the Mississippi Association of Supervisors Minority Caucus Scholarship on Tuesday. The Warren County Board of Supervisors presented Williams with his hard-earned scholarship for his hard work. Williams Williams is one of 14 students in Mississippi's 82 counties to win the $1,000 scholarship after submitting a well-written essay. The Vicksburg National Military Park played host to Vicksburg YMCA summer campers last week to take part in biology on the battlefield. Campers were led on a one-mile hike by natural resource manager Chuck Badel, which served to educate them about staying active and safe while in an outdoor setting. The park plans to host the same experience for their Junior Ranger Day campers on July 8th. And in our top story, Desmond Clinton, a 15-year-old being sought by U.S. Marshals for capital murder, has been captured. Clinton was one of two suspects wanted for the murder of Brendan Stuckey, a 32-year-old who was shot and killed in May on Sunset Drive in Jackson, Mississippi. Stuckey was found in the street suffering from gunshot wounds. He was transported to the University Medical Center but succumbed to his injuries. D'Angelo Jackson was arrested on Wednesday in connection to the crime. Clinton was later arrested in Jackson. Motives surrounding the case are unclear at this time. Keep your eye on our website for any updates. Come throw some axes. Have a drink with some friends. Get in on the action. We, we have fun friends. Deion Sanders has landed a four-star recruit. Wide receiver out of Dallas, Texas, Quadarius Davis has committed to Jackson State University. Davis is currently rated as a four-star athlete from Skyline High School, where he had a total of 14 touchdowns with over 800 yards. Davis will now be playing to side multiple top recruits who have signed with JSU that will be eligible to play in the fall. Porter's Chapel Academy basketball player Lawson Selby led the Eagles in points in a summer basketball game last week. Selby scored 22 points in the win for the Eagles, who played in multiple games during the summer tournament. He'll be returning next season to lead the Eagles once again in a run for a successful year. Alcorn State University will soon hit the football field and play a game for the first time since the 2019 season. The Braves will be led by head coach Fred McNair, who is entering into his sixth year as head coach, who helped the team to two SWAC championships. Just like in previous years, Alcorn signed to major recruits in the offseason and will be able to show their fans that they still got what it takes to win. It's now time for Alcorn to prove that they still run the SWAC. Bringing you a look at your local weather brought to you by the Carriage House at Levy Street, a great small venue for your next wedding reception or any type of gathering. Checking into our Thursday forecast, we see a high around 90 for the day with a 50% chance of rain and scattered thunderstorms. Low is going to be around 73. Then our Friday, we see an 88 for the high. Isolated thunderstorms, a 40% possibility through the day. Low is around 72. And on Saturday, 92 for the high. Partly cloudy skies, 30% chance of rain and a low of 74. Bobbing into birthdays with Bob's Frozen Custard of Vicksburg. You can bob on into Bob's and grab yourself a delicious snappy turtle today. We didn't have any birthdays emailed in to us today, but I guess that means nobody has any birthdays, right? Wrong! I know you do, so happy birthday to you if it is your birthday. And if tomorrow or the next day or the next day is your birthday, don't forget to send in your birthdays to birthdays at vicksburgnews.com and we'll give you a birthday shout-out. That's going to do it for this edition of your Vicksburg Daily News Briefing. Thank you very much for listening.